you ten years ago? Yeah. No. Do I look different? <laughs> what are you currently trying to, to do to, to get better? You know what? I'm just at about at a point of I don't care anymore. I sit around here and I, I wait to die. Basically, that's what I, I do. I'm so withdrawn from the public. Uh, if you want to know where Ron's at, uh, look on his front porch. 98% of the time, that's where I'm at. I walk to the post office, I ride my bicycle to the post office, and I come home. I don't go out of my way to socialize and can, you know, with a bunch of people. Right. You know, if all this is, is all related to Pegasus interferon or, or, and drugs, just drugs in general that doctors give you the shit. Because uh, over the years, they them ain't been good for me either. You know, you can't take uh, methadone, morphine, uh, uh, 650 somas a month. Um, Stayed all injectables, um, you name it, tall ones, uh, Percodan, uh, you know, all them drugs are all highly addictive drugs to begin with. Mm -hmm. Any but any time you take somebody and put them on on, on an addictive drug for any kind of time period, you created a problem in that person's body. You've upset the metabolism one way, shape, form, or another. Now that's my opinion. If I have to pick any more nowadays, uh, it's not hard for me to get drugs. I can go to the doctor and say, I need this, I need that, and I'll give it to him. But, I don't do that because I don't want to go back down that road again. Mm -hmm. uh, I stay with the marijuana. I stay with it because I know physically it's not going to hurt me. Um, helping me I see the pot helping me just like the other drugs did help me. The pot, I don't get the side effects that the other drugs have. And the pot is just like the other drugs. It's like you smoke it and like me, I don't smoke it to get high anymore. I smoke it to get, so I can just make it through the day. Um, but it's like, it's like the pill, you know, you got to take another one uh, to keep feeling better, mm -hmm. you know. Uh, so it's just a, a, like a temporary relief because without the pill or without the pot, then you're, you're just in pain and screwed all the time. You know? um, so that's another thing. But my thing is, if I'm going to have to be on, on a drug, mm -hmm. it'll be my choice of drug and not their choice of drug. They've already screwed me up. Right. And they had their chance. Yeah, they've had pretty much Take their chance. Up to you know? And that's why I kind of feel like, you know, there's there's not really a whole lot they can do for me other than give me a pill that I don't want. Mm -hmm. And So I'll probably spend what time I got left in pain and agony and 
uh, all kinds of crazy thoughts that I hope I never mm -hmm. act on. Yeah. You know? 